Hey gang, this is Speedcuber, and I'm going to give a quick example of Scumbium running on Classic on the Palm Pre. So let's go ahead and get Classic started up here. A uh, few things to note about this is the uh, biggest issue that I see is there is no escape button, which means you can't skip past your cutscenes and things like that. Um, it's also a little bit difficult to hit the tiny little uh, things you have to hit in these point-and-click adventures. Um, so as you can see, that was just classic, and we've got Scumbium loaded up. I've got uh, five games installed here. Uh, we'll start off with Day of the Tentacle. Uh, there's no music here, but there are some sound effects uh, that work. So as you can see, it loads right up. We get the noise, and we're off. So, like I said, since there's no escape, um, we're going. Uh, I've already gone through the intro for these guys and made a save game after the intro runs, so you can see a little bit of the gameplay mechanism here. But again, it's a little bit difficult to hit the correct button, especially when you're filming. So we'll load the first game on the list and here you can see we've made it into the mansion so uh, let's go into the office and you can look at say the camera he smiles and that's fun always make sure they get your good side and the picture quality is really quite good. Um, the camera is horrible, and I apologize for that. So let's try Loom. Uh, Loom, you get, of course, a lot better sound. Please choose your skill level. The intro is Welcome to very well done with the music and everything. takes it a little while to parse the mp3 file. The sound is stored in one 50 megabyte mp3 file. And here we have a save game as well. If I can get it to load. So there we are, Bob and Threadbear. It, clicking this leaf is almost impossible because you have to double tap to interact, and it's a very small target. You can zoom, but as soon as you zoom and then try and click anything, it weird things happen. So that mechanic's a little bit broken as well. Uh, we've also got Maniac Mansion, the original, the predecessor to Day of the Tentacle, working reasonably well. Here you can pick a few characters and go. And then you've got, of course, no Scumbium demonstration would be complete without Monkey Island. One of the best games of all time. And all the uh, music is again stored in MP3s and things like that. There's, of course, no voice. But um, it does work out reasonably well. And the sound is surprisingly good quality coming out of uh, having ripped it straight from the CD and converted to MP3 and all that. So there's Guybrush. And of course, you've got the scum bar. Go in there, see what's going on in the scum bar. start off the three trials and I don't have enough time right now to play Monkey Island yet again even though I wish I did and the last one I have installed is Monkey Island 2 which works out just as well except there's copy protection on this guy so you have to uh, I'm gonna type in some numbers real quick And then we uh, select 
star difficulty level and of course you want mega monkey mode none of this monkey island light business and there's Guybrush again only looking way cooler than in the first one that load button is very difficult to hit so uh... some of the other things that do not work at this time are uh, the landscape mode which would be really nice because then you'd have a little bit bigger targets to hit with these guys there's no sound on monkey island too if you hadn't noticed um, but in general i think you could uh... kill some time with this playing a game and things like that So i'm very excited to have it working and hopefully uh, that was useful to you. All right.